Welcome to ITW Extra, powered by JSA. I'm Barb Mitchell, coming to you today live from the floor of ITW at National Harbor. And joining me is Peter Van Bergel, CEO of the Amsternet, Internet, Amsterdam, excuse me, Internet Exchange. Welcome. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Uh, great to be here. Yeah, so great to have you. And I mean, we're only on day one and you've already, you, you know, we're off to a fast start. I think you had some news hit today. A new press release came out about a new internet exchange in uh, Bangkok. Correct. Yeah. Yeah, we have a couple of things uh, coming about. Uh, the Bangkok one we introduced today, together with our partners uh, HDC and IGS. Uh, and it's exciting because it's the first exchange where we can work nationally and internationally in uh, in Thailand. Uh, next to that, indeed, we announced uh, Manila uh, a while ago, and we're working hard also with our partner uh, Main One and um, and a new exchange in Lagos in uh, Nigeria. So yeah, all exciting news and uh, getting off to a busy start. Yeah, and I mean, I, I think could, maybe if you, we could step back from that, this is all amazing news and amazing growth for for your organization. Right. And talk about the some of the trends that are driving this expansion yeah. and, and the need for this for you. Yeah, so there's uh, two pieces to it. One is uh, that we are asked to come and help, so that's uh, oh, yeah. part of the trend, <laughs> of course, and uh, we we're happy to oblige. But it's also an element of um, um, uh, trying to build out the internet. So in our mission statement, we want to try and help build a better society through better internet. And it may be a, a, a big goal to achieve, yeah. but we believe with better internet, we can actually help uh, local communities thrive. So an element of it is just faster, more of it, but also an element is really in education and, and really uh, uh, sharing of information, etc. cetera. So um, you know, that's, um, the trend we're seeing is that in, in Europe and, uh, and, and the US, a lot of the internet, of course, is done. It works, right. but in more emerging markets, there's still a lot of work to be done to expand. And, and that's why we go into these countries and hopefully help build out the internet. Yeah, and help the entire economies of those, yeah, exactly. of those yeah. Uh, countries. And and so, you know, we, we had an interesting conversation before we were on air, and I'd love to share this with our viewers, just yeah. your thoughts on responsible uh, data sharing between the US and, and Europe yeah. and beyond, yeah. if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, so um, um, the US and, and Europe, European Union, are again negotiating or trying to negotiate a deal where they can agree on how to treat privacy. Um, and, um, and personally, I'm, I'm not too um, positive about the outcome of that because they've tried two times and I, I, I don't know, hopefully it's going to work out. But I think there's big differences in how Europe and the US look at privacy. So our view is more on let's try and figure out how you can responsibly share data and this is uh, for example in the healthcare sector or in others where you want to you have to share information you have to share data but you want to make sure that that's done in a way that if you are the owner of the data the other party is not taking advantage of that or your data is not being stolen or misused yeah. so we, we are developing uh, technology and services that can really help do that so that the owner knows your data is safe but the person that wants to use or the organization that wants to use the data also can have access to the data still. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, uh, yeah, add value to that. Mm -hmm. So that's where uh, we are going with it. And we believe we can therefore also protect privacy, even though it's different views of how to deal with privacy across the world. Yeah. I mean, it's such an important thing to consider and important for you to to take that stance, given, Absolutely. given the, the reach that yeah. you have into, yeah. into many markets. Yeah. Um, so... Is there anything else, you know, as you think about the rest of this week and meetings and conversations you're going to be having, anything in particular that you're most looking forward to for ITW? Um, not one specific thing. I think, again, the, the two elements of, of our mission, yeah, trying to build better internet in terms of really, you know, look around. All of this is about uh, giving us better, faster, more internet. Yeah. Um, so that's one part, and many of our meetings are about those, but it's also an element of really trying to add that value. So we truly believe as OM6 we are slightly different than many others. So we also spend a lot of time uh, talking to governments or regulators or partners to really uh, define what that is, better internet. Because there's also a risk of um, uh, what's in the, in the industry called the splinter net. So there's more and more countries, but also sometimes organizations that try and, and sort of uh, 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 carve out parts of the internet right. and we believe that's not the right way to go so we're also having a lot of discussions about how can we protect sort of the core values open neutral 
and, and allow you know, people like you and me to have free access to uh, whatever type of information. Yeah. So both of those are, um, are important parts of our, uh, of our uh, interviews and uh, we're passionate about both of them. So. Yeah, amazing. So thank you so much for, for joining us here. I know, it's, as I said, it's been a great start to the show already for you and lots of great conversations to come um, Absolutely. for you and your, and your clients and friends and partners uh, in the industry. So for anyone who may be looking to connect with you during the week or, or yeah. after when, when folks are home, how can they do that? Yeah, so uh, people being here, of course, can come to our stand. We're just uh, uh, at the exhibition floor uh, with uh, some of the team. Uh, they can go online and look at our internet uh, on our, at our website course on the internet yeah. uh, uh, am6.net or of course through uh, regular channels like uh, LinkedIn and uh, etc so uh, if they use uh, am6 in the search they'll find us okay. I'm sure all right thank you so much oh thank uh, you for th having me yeah and good luck to, to you and the rest of the am6 thank team you. for the rest of the week and thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV coming to today live from the floor of ITW at National Harbor stay tuned as we bring you more interviews throughout the rest of the day and week